day, Canada, to the O, to the N, to the T. TJ's having some work done on his house right now. So if I have to skedaddle or you see me run upstairs, it's because we need to talk to the TJ, to the man, okay? The architect. So yeah, that's what's happening. Getting some things and some maintenance, preventative maintenance before the winter hits. Hope everybody's doing well. I am TJ McMaster. We're going to try it with some abs and we're doing back and bias today. Any questions, comments, concerns, you let me know. If not, I'm just going to start doing it. Let's go. If you want it right now, let me know.
all is well. I am getting some property work done presently, so if you see me like jolt upstairs, it's because I gotta go and talk to some people about maintenance. But yeah, besides that, all is well. It's a nice day outside. Wednesday! Just chilling and killing. That's it. On season six of uh, Burn Notice, and it's getting kind of orange is the new blackish with Fee, so it's kind of getting cringy. But besides that, Chuck is also starting to do the same thing where they have him cut his hair now. He doesn't even look like a nerd anymore. So, time to find a new show in the future. Hope you're doing good, big dog. We're doing abs today, and then we're going to get into the back and biceps. Oh, yeah, getting a little bit of a pump on. Just a tad. Just a tad. Okay. Alright, gotta get back to the abs. Gotta keep the pump going.
That's quite the combat cocktail. <laughs> that sounds like the Arnold Schwarzenegger freaking uh, the Ar the Arnold Schwartz the Arnie classic. Except he pumped three D balls a fucking day. He admits that too in his documentary. They weren't illegal back then. It's like well, technically in Canada they're not illegal. The states they are. Or what is Canada's laws? It's illegal to purchase them, but it's not illegal to own them. Okay. Yeah, that's the law. I don't understand it. That's some. Cr that's, that's quite the pre-workout, though. Coffee and... I would say coffee and creatine. Man, vengeance. Oh, hey, vengeance. Hi. Hey. I don't even know what to say to you. I don't. I don't. Know. I don't know. I, I. I don't know. I don't. <sighs> that's a. <sighs> that's it. Um, I am not blessed, but how are you doing? And that looks. I have no idea who that picture is. To me, that picture looks like. Uh, Mike Babcock, fr the former Toronto Maple Leaf coach. That's what, who that looks like. The burgers were absolutely delicious. The two burgers that I had with lettuce, pickles, mayonnaise. Ah, la, 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 la. It was delicious. I didn't have any bacon though, so it wasn't the five guys. Yeah, but it was yummy. It was super, super yum, yum. It was as you're eating, you're like, mmm, 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 ah. That's how you're doing it. But how do you, I don't, <laughs> triple seven, hello. I don't know how to respond to that. I don't know. Th the pants make it look bigger, I don't know. Swing and a miss, not what I meant, not what I meant. Baseball term, don't be like that. And I know this music doesn't help, it's like, this music is not helping my argument whatsoever. You'd be like, no, put the red lights on. I am not changing my lights to red. We're not in the red light district. Yeah, yeah, whoop, whoop. Why you all in my ear talking a whole bunch of shit I ain't trying to hear? Luda! What's for dinner tonight? Stir fry. Stir fry for dinner. Yep, might have some soup. And s might have some salad for lunch. Might have a di might have a burger patty. I'm not sure. Made an extra one last night. We will see how that goes. Also, since there's some people here now, um, I am having some work done on the exterior of my house. So if you hear it, if you see me going like, "What the hell is that?" and run away, it's not Lincoln Park. I wanna run away, never say good. None of that. It's I need to go up and talk to the people. Communication is key. Focus. I'm getting some work done. So yes. Any questions, comments, concerns, you can ask the TJ. I am transparent, but just for the record, there is no McPukes in this shit. We're not doing coffee and Dynaball for dinner. We're sipping syrup, eating broccoli, chicken. We're doing the Myco Trend. No, we're not. <laughs> if I, yeah, people, I've, I've had people actually ask me, have, you, have, have I done HGH or Travelone? And it's like, okay, if you understand what those two compounds are, which I do, not because I'm a chemist or a chemical engineer, but because I've looked it up. I've read the research. Not on Wikipedia. Literally, HGH and Trebolone are... Um, they basically make you bigger. And I don't mean like Dynabol or like testosterone. Trebolone was is actually from China. And they use that to inject cows to make their friggin' bigger so they get more meat out of them. Yes, that's what it is. Now people shit that up the, into their body. So if I'm on Trebolone or HGH, which is human growth, growth being the operative word, hormone, I would be like twice to three times my size. It literally makes your head go like that. Look at the rock. The evolution of the rock. From I could, I'm not doing that. I basically stayed the same. I just get a little more shredded and a little more muscle over the years. That's it. But yes, if I was on the hard stuff, I would, li like, I'd be breathing like, <laughs> <laughs> where are my balls? Where are the chestnuts roasting on the open fire? No. Yes. 
big dog you've just asked me that oh cardio i'm like you asked me about coffee today you already asked me about that uh, no cardio today no abs i did abs i'm still doing abs but i'm not doing any bike today not not training the toothpicks today mm. ah timmy's timmy timmy timmy's all right so uh <laughs> Love some good meat. What? 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 Vengeance. B Sirloin beef is good. Go to Costco. <laughs> we are trying to be family friendly here. You're not helping. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I'm a good boy. How do you, do you want me, I'm not dancing to this, it's like... <laughs> See, there's literally no way I could ever go on stage or do a competition because I literally can't do it for more than three seconds without laughing at myself. How would I do that on stream? I'd be like, work it, work it. It'd be like friggin' Robin Williams. Packed, double front, double fronts. Can you see it? Is it working? Is it working? C can you see the flex? Watch it. Flex, flex, flex. I couldn't do that. <laughs> I'd be laughing at people. Like, yeah, I just, I wouldn't. I But I guess it would be board shorts, whatever that would be, a men's physique. So that's just, you stand there and you just, you do the, I guess you do the, the this type of pose or something. It's like that. And then you do the whole <gasps> inhale and look at that. Look at the vacuum, the sebum. Don't look at that. Don't look at don't look at my belly button. Don't look at it. Blink blink. Any groceries? What do you mean? Like did I do groceries? I didn't do shopping today. I'm not gonna be doing shopping for the next couple of days if I don't have to. I'm all good. All good in TJ's hood. Let's focus and drive. No, I have, I'm good. Did my Costco, got my produce, got my pop, got my lettuce, got my meat, got my meat, <laughs> got my sausages, my spicy Italian sausage. Okay, stop it. There's no Wiener Schnitzel here, stop. Okay, I'm gonna get back to my abs. Gonna do heel tappers or heel tap or heel huggers or whatever the fuck you want to call them. I call them back and forth, but technically they're heel tappers because you're supposed to be tapping your heels. It's for the obliques. Instead of doing the head, the instead of the weighted pull downs, I do this and it works. I also do that sometimes on the uh, on the baya ball. What's the baya ball? That's the big blue ball that I bounce on. I know you like watching me bounce on my blue balls. Just stop it. Stop it. That was freaking thrown right down the pipeline. If you didn't swing that out of the fucking home run, that's your own fault, not mine. If you're picking up what I'm putting down, catching what I'm throwing, hearing what I'm saying, that's all I'm saying, okay? Stop it. Um, I would, but what they're doing is actually like cinder block work and uh, patio stone work, so they're literally lifting concrete blocks. So I ain't saying shit. It's literally the stuff that I don't, I don't want, I would never do. I would actually hire somebody to do if I owned the house. So yeah, it's man, it's legit manual labor. So I appreciate the work they're doing and I'm just staying away. That's hard work in the sun, August. I am not saying nothing to them. I respect them and I let them do their job. <laughs> I know you're being I, I know you're being sarcastic, but when it comes to stuff like that, I just I it's like road work and stuff like that in the heat. I just respect. Thank you. Can you wait for five minutes while we do? Yeah, you can wait all day. I'm in the freaking air conditioned car. You are out there in the heat. Thank you for letting me drive on these roadways, which get me from A to B very easily. 
respect. R E S P E C T. That's what TJ means to me. Okay. Who's all on Debo? Well, no, I think most people are on the test or the. I wouldn't say treble on because not a lot of people are on trend. That's people. That's like the heavyweights because you're you're going to be a heavyweight if you take trend. I think most people are on test. They say they're on TRT, which is yes, it is testosterone replacement therapy. That's the technical term, medical term. But you're on testosterone. If you're getting an injection a week, you're on testosterone, which is fine. After the age of thirty, men's testosterone declines. That's a scientific and biological fact that has been proven for over 40, 50, 60 years. So a lot of doctors will say if you're depressed, if you're like, you're, if you're te if in men, if your testosterone is low, it literally affects your psyche, everything, your mental state, the whole nine yards. And that's not bullshit. Like I'm not telling people to go on it, but that is literally what happens. Like that's a fact. It's the one like compound in your body that affects almost everything when it comes to your mental state, your physical state, your like your emotions, the whole nine yards. That's why when people are on a whole bunch of stuff, they go stupid. But when you level them out, they're like, oh, I'm not depressed anymore. It's amazing. It's true. It's not for everyone and not everybody needs it. But most people on Instagram, YouTube and all that stuff are like abusing it, obviously. Like it's, there's a thing like if you're taking 75 cc's a week, that's not bad. If you're, if you're taking 500, well, you're not exactly on TRT now, are you? You're on the rocks, juice. Let's just say that. The broccoli and chicken. And no, I'm not ratting anybody out. People know this. Like, it's it's like like Michael Trent. It's a joke. He knows it. He's a fake natty. Doesn't care. He makes millions of dollars. Hey, it is what it is. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not hating. I'm just, like, being honest. That's all. Like, if I could be, like, uh, what's his name, uh... Jeff Cavalier, athletics.com. That's how he says it too. Hi, I'm Jeff Cavalier, athletics. If I could look like him, I would, trust me. Like, I wish I could look like him. I just, TJ's for hidden needles. That's the truth. T, like, I, the Saw movies, I can't watch because the needles in them, if I see a needle on TV, I literally get the cold sweats. I have a death fear of needles, so it's like, people are like, you ever done tests? Like, I <laughs> no. I would literally be like scared out of my mind and anxious non-stop for the whole week thinking about doing the injection. Like I couldn't do it. I wouldn't be able to sleep. It would have the opposite effects. Donut gains. Maple cream freaking gains. Not donuts. Maple cream. Specific. Maple. I need my syrup. I need my maple. Look. Look at the flag. Look at the flag. The what the flag that the fl I'm in a country where you can point at your flag and you don't get any shit. <laughs> Fuck. Hey, Benoit balls. Sorry, most your balls, but you know I'm Benoit balls. Archer phrasing. I would be if I juiced. I would be a freak, and I would like if I took if I did serious like the recommended dosage. I would probably be a prick. Like, I'm hyper as it is. Like, I'm wired. Like, when I hit the friggin'... When I wake up, it's like, I want to go. When it's bedtime, it's like, I'm dead. You could have a nuclear bomb go off, and I'm sleeping through that bitch. But I'm fucking hyper. I don't need shit to make me more hyper. Like, you know, uh, I am going to little baby family. I am going to little... That's... <laughs> the squirrel from Hoodwinked. Here's your coffee. What have I done? Yeah, that's why I like being down here in the basement with air conditioned. If I didn't have air conditioned right now, like my palms are literally, my palms are sweaty. Vomit on the sweat already. No, my palms are literally sweaty from coffee. Like, I can't touch my table. I have a motion wear table. It's absolutely gorgeous. I got it for half price. I can't touch the tabletop because I leave fingerprints because I'm so like that. If I was on this shit, I would literally be just sweating constantly. I'd be like, I'd be like, <laughs> Are you want something? No! really happened to me here huh? <laughs> why is your whole body red no reason why is your freaking heart pumping like that because I'm just a happy man I couldn't do it I couldn't even fake it and then it would just be because you know the libido is a little strong on TJ I'm a I am very very genetically gifted like the genes are here like daddy wears the good genes he's he, he, 
bequeathed them to myself. And uh, yeah, if I was on test, it would be, if I was on the regular amount of test, holy crap, <laughs> I would be a an aggressive male. I don't want to go any further and be like, I'd be a predator, but it would be like, it'd be bad. Okay? That's all I'm saying. Know your limits. Play within them. Like, I haven't even touched, I've never even touched my agar because I'm afraid of that shit. Or the weekender, the 48 hour one, I'm, I'm no. <laughs> yeah, no. Gotta behave. Work those hips. Work the, okay, see, I'm already, see, if I was on test, I'd be running, it would be hot tub highway. Hello, welcome to TJ's training. Welcome to TJ's tanning. TJ's training. You know what we're training you, Abe? <laughs> That's where it would go. It'd be declined. Fuck. If I juiced, I would... You know Aziz? That's literally what I aim for. And I will never achieve because he was on s a lot of shit. But that's my goal. Aesthetics is my goal. I would never want to be big because I don't want to maintain that amount of muscle and that amount of weight. Because I like having cardio and being able to like move around and having um, being limber. So I would love to be on something that would... Yeah, I don't know. That's the thing. I don't know. I don't know. It's also expensive and all that stuff, and yeah, I like my money. TJ likes his money. What are we going on here? Five people! I haven't even got... Okay, you guys got to stop talking to me and asking questions. This isn't just chatting, it's fitness, and all I'm doing is listening to tunes. I'm trying to do my abs here, and you're stopping me. Okay? Like, I have to get these things pumped. Like, look, they're, they're f look at how... Net like, they're flat. Look at that. There's nothing there. Like, do you guys actually like that? Really? You don't want... Really? Uh. <laughs> <gasps> Fuck me. No, stop it. Stop it. Okay, questions, comments, what do we have here? Any rain coming? I hear the rains are coming. Oh, that's not that. Um, uh, let me check. I have to check. This week is supposed to be a lot of rain, a lot of overcasting. So I, it, it says like the percentage, but when it says like, I call it torrential downpour because it's like just <laughs> like it's when the leaves just are doing that. But we don't get long periods of that. We'll get like light rain, torrential downpour for five minutes, and then it's gone. But that torrential downpour, like, messes up our, <laughs> our electric grid, which sucks. Um, what is the weather like? Oh, anybody, I'm also on Reddit now. TJ McMaster on Reddit, if anybody wants to send me DMs and shit. Also, Discord is in the... Uh, my, I have a Discord also. I do not do OnlyFans. I do not do Fansly. I do not do... TikTok, I do not do Instagram, Facebook, yeah, I'm just on here, and I'm also on Kick, and I also upload all my videos to my YouTube channel. I'm a very basic man, TJ's tech tarted, like this setup here, took five years to build. <laughs> I'm serious, TJ is tech tarted. Just like I'm math tarted, and I suck at geography. Yep, that's why I just, people are like, when are you going on holidays? I'm not. I don't want to go anywhere. Why? Because I don't know. <laughs> I'll get lost. I Discord. It's not I Discord. It's Discord. I'll, ex I'll put the link in my... There. There's your invite link if you're looking for it, people. It's Discord. Uh, weather. See, yeah, I focus. I'm like a freaking. I have like the attention span of a goldfish. Look at the castle. Look at the castle. See, it's just not good. Um, rain today? Probably not. No. Tomorrow. 
tomorrow's going to suck. <laughs> so yes, we have rain coming. Tomorrow's going to really suck. And then the weekend apparently is going to suck too. Fuck. I don't care. Like I said, the next two weeks are about streaming with you guys. I'm going to try and stream more. Which means I'm going to talk more because obviously if I work out for like 12 hours, I'm going to be dead. You guys are going to be like, no, we want to see it. We want to see the sweat going down the butt cock like Niagara. Not happening. I don't have a tushy. I don't even have an ass. It's like nothing there. I have nothing there. That's why I got to start doing legs again. Get the tushy in order. What? There's a body. Okay, hold on here. Hey. Hey. There's a bodybuilder online called Sam Sewell, who's the next popular, what, who the net, who's the next popular, 21 in juice to the gills. I like the guy, he's a great guy, but I predict bad health due to how much juice, which is the same. Sam Sulek? I'll look him up. I'm hearing my dog bark, I have to, see, hold on, I'll be back in two seconds, it's gotta make sure, yep, and I just heard the ding dong, so I will be back.
Okay, well I can't start, uh, it's great that the work is done, awesome, but yeah, give me a couple minutes because holy crap, apparently, uh, I, Sam Soul is the last thing I friggin' read, so give me 2.3, Sam, probably gonna be like the friggin' S-A, no S-U, Sam Sulek. Not one picture, they're all damn videos, images! Um, how, how, what? How old is he? 21? So yeah, he's, uh, literally the first picture I clicked on says Sam Ewok is going to have a heart attack. Uh, yeah, he's running, um, I'm going to, does he tell what he's on? But yeah, he's definitely juiced like that's, yeah, it's, uh, he looks like a, hev like a, he literally looks like a heavyweight. He, and I'm not going to like judge him but yeah he's obviously juiced he's a bodybuilder i mean he's gonna win shit tons he looks jacked but he's not gonna live long he reminds me of like rich piana most of these bodybuilders have weak genetics yeah well yeah Mo like most bodybuilders that have the genetics only take a little bit because that little will actually increase it if you overload your body your body gets immune to it and it doesn't do shit so but also, if you take it while you are younger, like in your prime, you're going to recover quicker and have much more time to do it, but you can't put as many in, you can't put as many compounds in. Like if you're smart about it, you do like minimal dosing or microdosing, and you would be way better off and healthy. Yeah, that's, uh, I'm not even talking about him. It's the whole HGH gut and all that shit. I'm on, I'm on most, I am all about aesthetics, not the, I don't, I'm not into the, the big, because then you have to, st I just, I don't find it nice. I would rather be able to do stuff, live longer, and have more agility. So, gonna get back to working out. Any questions, comments, concerns, let me know. And that's it. That's all. Well, yeah, like, if you look like that, you're going to have a following just because you're great looking. It's like girls on uh, Instagram or TikTok that are ugly don't really have a big following because no one likes ugly people. Sorry, that's how it is. <laughs> it's not surprising at all that he has a big following. And that's the thing. He has the following because of what he's willing to do to his body. I'm not. <laughs> so. I just, I, I wouldn't, I, no, pineapples. And then you're reliant on that, which is even worse. 
Yeah, he's smart. Like you don't make any, like you only make money on YouTube when it comes to social media, unless you're sponsored or uh, being tipped. Like you don't make money on Instagram, you don't make money on Facebook. You make money on YouTube. You make money on Twitch if you are an affiliate or a partner. You make money on Kick in the same way. Other than that, it's sponsorships, which 90% of the time, sponsorships mean you get a discount on supplements. You don't get paid. And that's garbage, because then you're, you're literally promoting somebody's bullshit for free. It's hilarious how much fitness injury is a scam. I was an affiliate for Fusion Bodybuilding when it was big, like 20 years ago. I was one of the very first affiliates for Fusion. I had an Instagram following of like thousands of people and all that stuff. All that, you know what I got from the sponsorship? 10% off. And then if people bought with your code, you get some money, which no one does. It's bullshit. There's no such thing as an influencer. You don't influence shit. No one's listening to you. They're just looking at your body and you're lying because you're refusing to admit what you're taking because then people would be like, oh my God. Because it's like, here's the thing. You take all these supplements for 10 years. Why haven't your body changed? They've done it, and all of a sudden, in five years, they look like that because they're not just on the supplements. Like, newsflash. Fuck. <laughs> Jesus Christ. And then it's like, well, define what, what steroids are. Testosterone's not steroids. Like, they're, they try and, like, argue semantics, and they don't even understand the compounded structure of it, so it's funny. It's fucking hilarious. Really, to what? Well, yeah, he would, he's earning a good living if he has, like, 500,000 followers or subs on YouTube and he has that many views, then yes, he is making some decent money. Because you don't make money on the shorts because there's no, there's no ad revenue in it. Think about it. The more money you make is the more ads they can pump out, but if you do a one-minute video or 30-second short, you don't see an ad. You're literally not monetizing that video. Aha! That's how it works. I'm tech tired, but I know about my money.
That is new. Benoit Balls, Monsieur, that is new. I have no idea what a barn door back is, but I'm going to assume it's a compliment. I've never heard of that in my life. I've heard, like, you couldn't hit the broadside of a barn. You couldn't fight your way out of a wet paper bag. I've heard those terms, but I've never heard of a barn door back, but I appreciate that. That's going to be one of my uh, my hashtags up there. <laughs> I like that. I'm going to look it up, too, but, yeah. Barn door back. I like that. I like that. That means it's grainy, I'm assuming. But yeah, barn door. Alright, first of all, thank you, Benoit Balls, Monster Balls. The barn door back wasn't a grainy thing, it just meant like ripples, and I will fully take that as a compliment. Thank you very much, appreciate that. Second, I need to get some hydration, but I need also a little uh, a little energy, so we're going to go up and get an espresso, so I'll be back in like three minutes. Stay on the line, if not, I will be RB. Any questions, comments, concerns, let me know. We're doing biceps isolation because we really want to work all the muscle groups instead of having like one side bigger than the other or certain things bigger not going there. Stop it. Stop it. Also, if anybody wants to uh, not go in there. Not go in there.
Oh, and um, I think, and I have tried it in the past. Like I said, I'm 100 transparent. Anivar is was the uh, thing that I chose to dabble in back in the day. You can look that up. That's what I used to like. Some people are like you're just gonna get so big and blah. Look up what Anivar does. That's all I gotta say. Oxycodone. That's all. It's not oxys, but it's oxycodone. Look up what that does, and it has, it's basically the opposite effect.
All right, so I'm going to do uh, three more sets with biceps, and that way then we will do pose up. Then we'll be it for today. Tomorrow we will be back with chest and triceps. That is what we're doing. We do the combos. We do the combos here, and obviously we're doing this. we got to keep this going. Do you want to see a weird thing? That's called by having core strength and muscle control. Freak of nature, TJ.
I've been trying out a new platform, Wendy. Frozen Burgers. Bob's Burgers! Les, Les, quit following me from in front. Um, yeah, I've been trying a different platform that is better for creators, i.e. monetization, but doesn't have the following, so tried that, but now I'm sticking to uh, Twitch for the next week or two. I'll be here. I'll be here. Daddy's gone. Daddy's gone. Uh, good old American dad. No, yeah, I, I agree. I was on Kick. Uh, no, I don't think Kick has ads. I'm not sure, but but it has a uh, a resolution limit, so I can't be streaming like 2160 by. What am I streaming here? Yeah, 21 2160p by 60. Like I don't know how the hell I'm even getting that on this fucking platform. But I do not get that on Kick, and it's also a lot darker. I find, but it's it is what it is. Yeah. Well, no, 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 Wendy, come on, come on now. Don't be like that. We'll stay here. Shit, I like your shit. That's my shit. That's how I spell shit, so I don't get in trouble. You're gone. Uh, let's go. It's the first time I've seen that without me doing it. What the hell? God damn. The stream must go on. Go on. Go on. The stream must go on. Yes, that's right. DJ TJ. I don't know what Kick has. They could have Hot Tub. I don't know. I I don't watch it. I create content on them. They probably have Hot Tubs because everybody knows that you got to go and watch the people. Oh, I accidentally flash, but I'm making you too much money, so you're not going to ban me. Oops. Whoops. Shout out to Disney, who their new Snow White, if you call it Snow White, um, flopped immensely. Dumpster fire, no money made. Ha <laughs> ha. That's what happens when you try and push it on people. Partly. What? Partly. But yeah, I don't watch any uh, other buddy. I don't watch anybody on stream at all when it comes to Twitch or Kick. I just stream, so I have no idea what they have. I think they have more categories than uh, Kick or uh, Twitch has, but I'm not sure. I don't know. Don't know. Don't know. I don't know. Don't know what I can say. But for right now and for the next uh, week or two, we're going to be solely streaming here. That's how it is. So there's no reason to question. What? Well, yeah. It's like just chatting, though. People are just want to talk, and then it's all... See, I can't go into just chatting or anything like that, because the mentality is, like, for Twitch, is very teenage, I guess. And I'm 45, so... I can't argue with emotionally out-of-control kids, which is what I call them. So it's difficult. That's why I stick to here, because it's like, this is a fitness stream, facts and fitness. I can be honest about what female, what would happen with females took testosterone in fitness. We could talk about that if you wanted to. That wouldn't be an opinion. That would be a fact. <sighs> Go down that rabbit hole. We'll see what happens. No, I'm joking. Well, Wendy, to be fair, though, that's what most chem sites are. Like, you go on to any other... That's what chem sites are. You're watching girls couples, men, whatever you're into, do stuff while well, you can't get with them. That's, it's the fantasy. That's the point. It's like porn. People watch porn constantly, and you're never going to get with them. It's the fantasy. That's kind of what it is. The key is making your fantasy a reality, if it's possible. If it's possible. You got to get the twisted people on. <laughs> you have to find the twisted people, and it's usually the quiet ones. The ones that are quiet are the ones that... Uh, Danger, danger, danger. <laughs> All right, a few more sets and then we're done.
Okay, I've done a whole bunch of different uh, techniques and exercises, so I'm going to do a third different one. I'm going to switch it out, and I'm going to do the Athlean X, the one where you take the, bi the biceps. You can tell the blood is not rushing to my brain right now because I'm talking about bi biceps and blood, and I'm talking about barb. Jesus. Well, everybody's heard about the birds. Stop. I'm going to take the dumbbell, invert the arms like you know I love to do for the peak, and we're going to do this. A couple sets of that. Okay. See, a lot of people, well, Wendy, to be fair, um, I'm, I'm going to base on your name, you're a female. Most females, it's get in there and get out, whereas guys, they actually prefer to watch and stuff and edge, I guess is the term. I don't know. But yeah, so most men don't, like, s they sit around and watch and watch and watch. Whereas I'm assuming, if you, like, based on your name, you're a woman, you're just in and out, boom. Like, most women have, like, scenes or whatever they like, they get in and they get out, that's it, let's go and continue. Whereas men, it's, it's like an addiction, ergo, like, way more. Like, they're constantly streaming it, like, five hours, all that shit. But I'm I'm sp I literally am speaking out of my ass. Obviously, I don't I I'm a man, so I don't know how women are when it comes to that stuff. I'm just they're more picky. I'm assuming. You know what I mean? Like men are like, what do you like? Man, whatever. Women they have. Phew. So. Yeah. And I'm not saying I understand them because I don't. I nope. Don't say that I'm saying I understand because I don't. I'm just assuming that they're way more complex than men. Take that as you will. <laughs> Alright, biceps, inverts, peak training, pose down, protein, stir fry, then I might be hot bath tonight. Stop thinking.
My hair is salt and pepper. My hair looked that the way. You gotta fucking love the, Ma the Austin Matthews. I call that the Austin Matthews because he's basically turned into Ron Jeremy, but healthier. Tell me I'm not. Tell me I'm wrong. Yeah, what do you think, Chris Christie? What do you think about my hairs? Do you want to know how long I've been growing it for? I actually have the times. Well, I don't have the exact date. I shaved my face and um, either you either stall and cold or you call it the Mr. Clean. Shaved my hair and my face the night before the Leafs played their first game in the first round of the playoffs last season. I cut, I shaved my beard off when they lost and I've grown it, I've continued to grow this. So that is literally how, you can Google that, the date. That's how long this has been growing. And it, I just, I want to see what I can do. I haven't had hair this long in literally two decades. So. Can you do strange things with your strange muscles? Well, what, what strange things do you want to see? I don't know. What do you consider strange? <laughs> That's a, is that a rabbit hole we want to go down? I'm not sure. This is a family stream. I don't think it's set to mature. I'd have to double check, but I do not think so. So we'd have to we'd have to be a little careful. People are like you're being careful, and yet you have hashtag muscle daddy and hashtag dumb. Well, Google it. Shut up. <laughs> Sometimes all I think about is you late night in the middle of June. Heat waves been faking me out. All I think about is you, late night in the middle of June. Street they've been freaking me out. Ain't need you when I be on now. Usually I put on some TV. Candle lights. No, that's an actual setting with my lights, and we're not going there. Do you want deep candlelight dinners with TJ? A little bit of wine, a little bit of Pinot. I'll put my robe on. I have a robe. I do have a house coat with a hood. I look like a Mike Tyson boxing without the muscles. And being black. And a lisp. And the money. And probably the, the blessed girth. So basically I have the, I have a white fucking house coat. <laughs> your biceps are bigger than the last time I watched your stream. Well they've grown a little bit. And I'm also pumped. So And also the camera's live so 10 pounds. But yeah a little bit. I'm pumped today. At the back. I appreciate that though. Thank you. I appreciate that. Looks can be deceiving, but the motivation is there, which is a positive, so we're good. Street wave been freaking me out. Can't make you happy now. Sometimes all I think about is you. Late nights in the middle of June. Street wave been freaking me out. <laughs> Boom! Miracle of movement, Lena Genetti. Brooklyn Nine Nine. Okay, so we're gonna do a couple more sets and then we're done. Okay. <laughs> you like the left side? Okay. Okay, I was an idiot. That hurt. That slap hurt more than the fucking muscles. Oh! I like slapping bums, not slapping myself. Female bums. Apologies. Yes. Sorry. TJ's a little hetero. 
Metro, I like to say. Metro. Straight guy that cares about the way he looks. <laughs> Back before it was 50 million things. But we're not going down that fucking Disney rabbit hole. Can you still move your chest and abs? Um, I... I don't know if I can move my abs. I can flex them. My chest, yeah. It's all just, it's just, I'm just flexing, that's it, it's like this. It's just being able to flex your, you just have to have enough muscle to flex, that's all. I don't know how to move my abs, though, I don't know, like, I can do the, the roll. Or I can do the, like that, but other than that, like, it's just tighten them up. Tight. <laughs> you hear the grunt, it's like, ah! <laughs> That's what asks me when I'm doing abs, like at the start of my workout. Then they're all popping and shit. I don't have to sit here and be like, I'm good. See, that's why I would never do shows, because you know the guys are. Go! <gasps> I can't feel the fucking thing. <laughs> I don't want to have like friggin' muscle cramps like my whole body. I'm good. I've seen those shit. I've seen the muscle gym fails. I don't want to have that. I don't want to be a gym fail. I want to be a gym motivator. Fitness over 40, bitches. Fitness, fitness break. What was it called? Body break. Until next time, keep fit and have fun. Body break. That was the original, the more you know fucking rainbow before it became a goddamn statement of bullshit. Fuck. Tis it? Tis it? But yes, I don't know how to move my abs, Chris Christie's. I can flex them. I can, like, do stuff, but I can't actually. Do you have V-line? I don't know. No. No. I don't have the, the C-U-M-G-U-T-T-E-R-S. Spell that out. I'm not saying it out loud. I can get in trouble. That's leg lifts. People that want the V, leg lifts. Leg lifts. That's all it is. It, think about it when you have a bend. Like, what do you mean? Like, when you have a bend in something, con when you're c something's constantly bending, it has that bend. So this is a leg lift. See that? That's how you get that. It's literally just leg raises, pulses. Go, 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 go. You can be... I've seen guys that are, like, overweight with a beard belly that still have that. It's all in leg raises. Like, people that walk up and down stairs constantly have it. It's leg raises, leg ups, knee ups. That's all that that is. This is a completely different story. Let's be honest. And the sides here are twists. Weighted, see? Weighted twist. When you tighten it, you go to the side. That's how you get that. It's weighted Russian twists. Or they have like that ball, that 10 pound ball that you do, but that's what it is. This is like, you have to go side to side, ups and downs, and this side to side shit standing up. I, I can feel it, but it doesn't work for me. I like to have the resistance constantly. So, I guess, do I have the V-line? That's up to you. You tell me. <laughs> I can't go any lower. Sorry. Can't do it. That's how you get banned. And I have not enough followers. I don't make Twitch enough money to be able to afford. I don't have the Joe Rogan. Fuck you, money. <laughs> Alright. Doing one more set, biceps, I'm going to do the doubles, I'm going to grab the 15 pound dumbbells and we're just going to do bicep blasting until my arms can't do it, then we're going to do a pose down, I will upload the video and all my streams like I always do every day to my YouTube channel, check them out, leave a comment, hit that like button, hit the sub button, do whatever you want, tell all your friends, okay, positivity, no emotional baggage, just happiness, okay, that's what we're doing here. All the other stuff, you can go somewhere else. I'm not hating. I just, this is positive, and that's all that I want. Even if it's like willful ignorance, positivity. You need it. There's too much of the other stuff going around. So, one more set, and then we're going to call it a day. Holy shit, we've been going for two and a half hours. We're conversing. It's fine.
All right. That is it for today. I appreciate all those likes, follows, and comments. You guys keep it on your end. I'll keep it on my end. I'll keep up with the fitness. You keep up watching and telling your people and chatting with me, and then that's all good. Beautiful relationship with none of the social media drama. Any questions, comments, concerns, hit me up on my YouTube channel. In the comments, I reply to everything. 100% transparency. Till tomorrow, lift heavy, lift strong, most of all lift, and be safe. Muscle daddy out. Smile.